Welcome to another Maxi Shine review. Today we're going to be looking at the new Radeon HD 4870. It comes with uh, GDDR5, 512 megabytes of memory, PCI Express 2, and is Crossfire ready. This card has been getting a lot of attention due to the fact that it's um, very cheap. In fact, I picked this one up for $329 Australian, which is about a third of the price of the GDX280. We'll go ahead and open it up and see what you get in the packaging. If this does live up to what they say, it sure is, is going to be a nice comeback from uh, ATI. A lot, of, a lot of ATI fanboys out there just waiting for something like this. I'll just go ahead and open up the packaging and see what you get in this little box. Very compact in size compared to the GDX280. Okay, just your plain brown packaging, not expecting much from GE Cube. We'll just put out, pull out the um, card itself. Let's see what this looks like. Straight on, I'm noticing it's very light. A lot smaller than the um, 3870X2. There you have it. ATI's um, response to Nvidia's new cards. I'll just put that aside and see what's in the package. What else we get in here? Mm, get your standard your uh, converters DVI to normal VGA you get your crossfire connector there some component out just get what you usually get with graphics cards put that aside we'll go back to the card I'm not sure if you can see that Fairly average looking. Um, wow, two six pin uh, plugs instead of one eight pin and a six pin. Obviously requiring less power than the old X2. Let's just put them side by side. Wow, this X2 certainly weighs a ton. I'm not sure if you can see that. Well, that's them sitting side by side. You can see the X2 a little bit taller, a few inches, maybe two or three inches taller. A, a lot heavier. The fan design is very similar using a copper heatsink in the red uh, clear plastic. You can see they're side by side. So this is meant to be a replacement for this thing. Same sort of layout underneath. Come to expect from ATI. Here's just a quick preview of what's lined up in the next few videos. Starting from the left there, the 9800 GTX, which we're going to be comparing to the 4870. Also, uh, three GTX 280 Extreme Editions in Tri-SLI. We're also going to be testing one of those against the 4870. See how good it does against NVIDIA. And also the uh, 9800 GX2s in Quad-SLI. There, going towards the right. So stay tuned for the next few videos, we're going to be comparing all of these cards.